One person is dead and another is in the hospital with life-threatening injuries after a shooting in East El Paso. Thank you for joining us for KTSM 9 News at 6. I'm Estefania Safer. Daniel and Natasia have the day off. This happened at the 1600 block of North Zaragoza in East El Paso near the Cincinnati Bar and Grill East and the Dirty Sanchez Tequila Bar. Police say the shooting happened at a bar, but it's unclear which one. KTSM 9's Tatiana Favela is live from the scene with what we know so far. We're here right beside uh, Dirty Sanchez Tequila Bar, where witnesses from last night tell me that dozens started ambushing out of this back pat patio area once they heard the gunshots, and as they were running out, even leaving their shoes behind, as you can see right here. inside look from one of the bars where you can see and hear all of the chaos. This video was shared by Benito Urias, who says he lives in El Paso and he was visiting from Odessa, or he was in El Paso visiting from Odessa. The call came in around at 11 p.m. last night, and police say the shooting happened at a bar. Again, there's still no update on which bar it was exactly. However, witnesses that were at Dirty Sanchez last night say this was too much too soon. I think it's very traumatizing for just to know that we, you know, it was the night of the benefit concert. It was, we're healing from the Walmart, what happened recently. And um, I think it was more like knowing that we heard the gunshots. It was kind of like, is this happening again? Now, according to police, the suspect left the scene. He's being described as a black man and was last seen driving northbound on Saragossa in a black Jeep or SUV type vehicle. The victims have yet to be identified. Now, the investigation is still ongoing. We'll make sure to bring you the latest updates as soon as we learn them on air and online. For now, live in East El Paso, Tatiana Favela, KTSM 9 News.